everybody, Ace Trainer Liam here, and welcome to the latest episode of the Pokemon Sun Wonder Trivia Lock. I got a lot of uh, stuff about yesterday's title because I left in the the thing that my batch rendering system leaves at the end, which is like Windows Media Audio, and also because I forgot to change the number in the thumbnail title. My argument is, hey, look, a picky pack. Is that my picky pack? Oh, a picky pack has turned up in our Pokepelago. Well, that's good news. So hopefully, we can um, get this picky pack to join our party. Oh wait, there's a Wingle, of course! Yay, Wingle's gonna join us! So we can Wonder Trade this Wingle right off the get-go. That's beautiful, let's give it a nickname. Uh, A, C, E. <clears throat> let's do this, let's Wonder Trade it. Uh, send to a box, please. So, I'm gonna... I'm gonna head out of Pokepelago. Please, let's leave. Yus. Go back to our regularly scheduled programming, but yeah, just just cut me some slack, right? I here's the here's the story behind yesterday's and the day before's video, right? Which is I recorded those videos at about ten or eleven p.m. after my Friday live stream ended. I had to be up at like five six in the morning to go to WinCon, um, which is in Winchester, which is a long way away from where I live, and you know. I got tired, and maybe my editing wasn't as good. I apologize, but, you know, you could at least appreciate the dedication that it took to make sure I had videos going up for you guys. I try my best for you. I try. But hen anyway, let's wonder trade. Let's wonder trade this Wingull and see if we get anything crazy. I have listened to you guys as well. I've read the comments, obviously, so um, we will swap our Voltorb for our Charmander. Let's get rid of this Wingull, if you please. And I've tweeted out to say that we're Wonder Trading. So don't you worry. Hopefully I can connect with one of you lovely people. Let's just update this to say Wonder Trading again. Just ready, just ready for the next time, if there is a next time. But we are on our way to the Grand Trial of Kahuna Olivia. So, yeah, it's going to be fun. It's going to be fun. But answer me the question of the day, which is going to be... Which is your favourite Pokemon movie? So mine is the first movie, which is the one with Mewtwo. Well, I say the one with Mewtwo. There's a couple with Mewtwo in, but the original Pokemon movie. That was beautiful. I remember watching that at the cinema. That's incredible. What we got? A Porygon! Wow! Okay. That's interesting. I mean, Porygon would be quite good for a, a playthrough. I might have to trade it to myself and trade it back, though. Get us a Porygon, too. Wow! Alright. Wowza! Roughly 20 years ago, it was artificially created, utilising the latest technology at the time. I like that, roughly 20 years ago. I like that. Okay, well, that was successful. So, we'll keep Porygon. But I'll put Charmander in the party for now. I feel like Charmander's going to be a nice little addition. So let us head through Diglett's cave first. And we're going to get attacked already by Diglett, no less. Alrighty. Come on, Jang Moo, you, you can take down this Diglett really easily with a nice, lovely brick break. Brick break? Let's do it. Please, please do it. Ooh, our speed fell, but we're going to brick break. It's going to take down the Diglett. No one's going to complain. My Jangmoo was so proud of itself. Good job. Can you gain more experience, please, and level up? That'd be great. Okay, let's go up the stairs. I think there's like one guy left in here to battle. Oh, no, wait. Aether Foundation. Phew, with Olivia in charge, we finally managed to make some headway against those Diglett. Oh, Alola, we're members of the Aether Foundation. We support Pokemon conservation. It seems like Team School was responsible for the Diglett and Scape getting so riled up and bringing them all up to the surface. Oh, Team School is this group of troublemakers, you see. They seem to delight in interfering with trainers and their Pokemon. Yeah? Diglett normally live in elaborate systems underground tunnels that take years to dig out. We're here to ensure they return to their tunnels and let people pass through here without having to fight so many Pokemon. Oh, sure. Some of the Diglett are still stuck on or nearby the surface, so be careful. Yeah, I, I don't believe you guys are, are conservationists at all. Nobody does, really. Oh, there's one guy in there that I can't get to yet, so... Oh, no, you can. I think you can get around to him, mate. Okay. Did I just have a conversation with myself? I might have done. 
Hey, it's another Diglet. Let's do this. Let's take down this Diglet. Yeah, don't you worry, Jack Mawo. I see you. Go for a brick break. Go for a brick break, darling. Damn that mud slap. Dropping my accuracy. But we still hit the brick break. And down goes the Diglet. Oh, he's happy. She's happy. Whatever she's supposed to be called. Come on. I think if I go down this way, I can get to where that guy was. Ooh, okay. Just just play it cool. I ain't done nothing to antagonize nobody. Oh, I think there's a TM through there, but I don't have Machamp yet. But there's this guy to fight. Hello. Dig a hole! I mean, I mean, what, now? Just in front of you? Is that, is that what you want to see? Okay. My name is Jeff. <laughs> oh, it's such a dead meme. Oh, I, I really want to hurt myself for that one. All right, let's go and use Brick Break on this Rog and Roller. Rog and Roller is going to get dropped like a bad habit. We're just constantly spamming Brick Break all the way through this cave. Everything here is weak to Brick Break. Oh, Rog and Roller speed's going up. Okay. There's the Rock Blast. Uh oh. Oh, okay. I think we can take even five of these. Hit two times though, that's fine. Here comes the Brick Break. We're still faster than Rog and Roller, and down it goes. Perfect. Perfection itself. What's next? Oh, Arcanine's level 29. Clever Arcanine. But it's an in Mud Bray. Uh, will I change Pokemon? Shall I switch? Oh, I just want to, yeah. Yeah, let's just bring in Sylveon and take out Mud Bray in like one draining kiss. Just because. Come on, Sylveon. There's Mud Bray. Let's go for the draining kiss. Oh, he's biting. Okay. I don't know why. You're about to die anyway. Here it comes. Ooh. There's that stamina. Okay, Mudbray's storing energy, but he's going to die this turn anyway. So that's wonderful. That's, that was a nice easy battle. Good job. Go team. Thank you very much. I need to use a potion on our Jangmoo. Just to make sure. That I am good. I'm just going to send a message really quickly. Uh, you ring me the. Cool. Just because my DS needs charging, <clears throat> and I don't feel like leaving the room. Um, oh, item, lovely. So I think there's a guy over this way. There's a guy right there that wants to fight. Oh, Zygod thingy. Thank you very much. Oh, he's got me. Okay, cool. We can do this. We're going to take this guy down. I think... I don't think this guy has anything that's particularly difficult. Ooh, match up. Bring it. Bring it to me. Thank you. <laughs> It's good having servants. Ooh, we could take down Machop, I reckon. I should have used a potion. Didn't use a potion, did I? Let's go with a brick break and hope for the best. Probably should have switched out. Oh, definitely. Revenge? Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. We definitely <clears throat> need to switch Pokemon for Sylveon. As long as it doesn't have Pursuit. Good. There we go. There's that Revenge again. But it's not going to be very effective on a Fairy type, obviously. So we'll just go with the Draining Kiss and win the battle. Look at that super effective hit. Lovely. Well done, Sylveon. Get your health back. Brilliant. Down goes match up. Everybody's happy. We defeated Vaklav. Right. 
Oh, who we bumped into? Team Skull! <clears throat> ah, no way. Just when things were starting to heat up, yo. Got surrounded by Diglett and beat up, yo. Yo, since when could Diglett use beat up? I'm so mad now I want to beat up on some fools. Don't be mad because you're the fool who was dumb enough to be here right now. Liam! Oh, hey. Uh, I was wondering who you were playing around with without me. And it's Team Skull. You want some? That's how we say hello. Nice knowing you, punks. Oh, boy. Is this going to be a double battle? Or is it going to be a singly battle? It's a double -A. <coughs> But we have to battle with Hal, which kind of sucks. Ooh, Salander and Fomantis. All right. I'm going to use a potion on my Jangmoo to start off with. Just to be safe. It doesn't really necessitate a hyper potion, Liam. Yeah, you're right, you're right. So here's the super potion. Okay. He's thrilled to bits. Electro ball from the Pikachu onto the Salander, I assume? Yup. Smog, we avoided it. Razor Leaf. Gonna hit everybody. Not do a lot of damage. Quite a bit to the Pikachu, though. Um... Let's go for a brick... No, let's go for a Dragon Tail on Fermantis. Because Pikachu's doing a good job on the old... Uh, oh, you're going to attack the Fermantis. That's fine. Salandit used Smog. Oh, Fermantis used Ingrain. Okay, got to be careful. We're going to go Dragon Tail and knock it out in one hit. That was beautiful. Good job, Jangmoo. Our Pikachu grew to level 31. Minior's level 37. I think that's Minior. Let's rock boom on the Salandit. You're going to Electro Ball. I don't think you'll kill it. I'd like to get the final kill. Smog hit the Pikachu. That's not good. And poisoned it. Poor thing. Alright, here we go. Down goes Salandit. Well done, Jangmoo. Down it goes. We're almost at level 30 for Jang. Good job, whoever that was that got to level 28. Beautiful. Yo, step off enough with the beating up, yo. We may not be trying to take over the world or nothing, but we're still as hard as a bone out here. I mean, I don't, I can see that from your trousers, dude. See you on the flip side. Oh, I did this voice totally wrong. Man, Liam, when I fight with you, it's like even my Pokemon feel more at ease. You really are some kind of trainer. That's it. I just got to give you something. Max Ether, thank you very much. Just the one. Max Ether to restore all the PP to one of your moves, you know? Pretty great, right? Now I'm going to go have more fun with those Diglett. See ya. What's he going to do to those poor Diglett? I'm going to... Actually, no. We, we could do with a couple more battles to get the... Um, to get Jangmoo to level 30. But we do need to go back and face the guy that wants to face everybody who has... Um, once you've defeated all the trainers... So let's go. We can take down Zubat with a rock tube very easily. So let's do that first of all. Here we go. We're going to go rock tube. Let's do it. Easy peasy. Good night, Zuby. Thanks for coming. Down you go. Oh, we're nearly there. Nearly at that level 30. Alrighty, let's head down. I think we'll probably end up in one more battle before we face this guy. Nope, okay. Looks like you did what I asked to beat all the trainers in this tunnel, huh? Then my Z-powered challenger. Do you want to compare Zs with me? We'll see what Z is the best. Let us have a Z battle to Z-prove who has the best Z moves. Uh, yeah, sure. That's a good answer, but I hope you're ready. My Z-power is not to be trifled with. Our full force Z-power competition begins now. Are you, are you for real, mate? Because you talk like an idiot. You look like an idiot as well. Hariyama. Okie dokie. I am terrified. Alright, let's do this. Our best bet is to just switch into Sylveon. Because we don't want to get Z-powered. We don't want to get hit with the Z-move and lose Jangmoo. Oh, here he goes with the all-out pummeling. 
Well, wasn't I clever to switch? Who uses a Z move on the first turn? That's just rude. Okay, here we go. Oh boy. Oh man. Thanks, Hariyama. It's not very effective. Let's try a draining kiss and see how effective that is. Boom! Oh, I'd say that's pretty effective. Force palm, not going to do a lot. Oh, but it did paralyze us, okay. Cute charm has infatuated the Hariyama, that's perfect. Why don't you shake off that paralysis, Sylveon? Hariyama is in love and is immobilized by love. We're paralyzed and can't move. Gathered all its energy to break through its paralysis. Hey, well done. So we're no longer paralyzed. Perfect. Gotta love. Always train your Pokemon. Always love your Pokemon and always give them that max affection. Back up to full health. Hariyama goes down. Easy peasy. Well done, Sylveon. You've earned that. Yay. Jangmoo grew to level 30. That's fantastic. Anyone else? No. Thanks, Black Belt Greg. You've done great. Very well done. That is some real Z power. Your Z is the most Z of any Z. Let me reward you with this token to show you how, how highly I value and respect your Z. A max revive. We did that all for a max revive. There are probably other Z trainers like me out there in Alola. If you want to achieve the ultimate in Z, you search them out and challenge them all. Just, just shut your mouth. You just wasted my time, dude. Where are my super repels? There they are. Because I want to get through this cave now. I don't want to sit around here all day. Idiot, man. Friggin' Max Revive. Who do you think I am, Max Revive? I'm on a friggin' Quadlock. Quadlock? Trivia Lock. That's the one. Way to forget your own playthrough, Liam. Hey, Hal. Bye, Hal. We are free! We are on Route 9. Route 9 is a new route, which means that we can do trivia and all that jazz. But first... Oh, wait. Have we been on Route 9 before? This looks vaguely familiar. Hello. I haven't had any cases. I'm so bored. How about a battle? We haven't been on Route 9 before, because otherwise we'd been in Kony Kony City already. Yeah, you're right. Challenged by police officer Haruki. Okay. Sent out Growlithe. We, we could take on Growlithe. We can rock to him it. Let's do it, kid. Are you ready? Ooh, that Intimidate's dropped her attack, though, so our Rock Tomb isn't going to be as good, but don't you worry. Let's... I used Brick Break. Why did I use Brick Break? I wanted to lower its speed by using Rock Tomb. Growlithe used Fire Fang. It's not going to be very effective. Unless it burns us. That'd be really annoying. Rock Tomb. There we go. Beautiful. One more, and we're done. Down goes the speed of the Growlithe. It's going to use Flame Wheel. That's going to be rather annoying. Don't burn me. Good. Good, good, good. And there you go. Down goes the policeman. I don't know why the police want to fight me. I haven't done anything. Yeah, that's what you get. That's what you get when you mess with me. Stupid man. Well, if we can catch a Pokemon on this route, well, that would be great. Let's see. There's a, there's a sightseer here. This way heads to the Ruins of Life. Hello. The dead can sleep in peace here, here in the shadow of Tapu Lele's sacred ruins, the ruins of life. They say it's why Memorial Hill was built here long ago. Oh, there appears to be a fishing hole. And there appears to be an X accuracy in a really obviously placed secret item spot. There's a fisherman here. I don't want to use a repel. I want to pick up this netball. And is there is there a fishing spot here? Yes, there is. Here we go. Whip out that rod, boy. Nothing seems to be biting. Don't give me that. More effort. Maximum effort, mate. We'll get it. We'll get it. Don't worry. Just be patient. Come on. No. Something will bite. Maybe that fisherman's causing the problem. There we go. I knew you could do it. Bum, bum, 
Oh, it's a love disc. What a pathetic Pokemon. I can't wait to send this to somebody. Here we go. So uh, let's jump straight in with the quick ball. Quick, 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 quick ball. Off we go. Oh, let's get ready to do some trivia, boys and girls. Oh, boy. Lovely. We got a love disc. Come on. Yep, good job, Jangmoo. Good job. Good job. Love disc data will be added to the Pokedex. Wonderful. Why don't you check out what kind of Pokemon you just caught? It's the Rendezvous Pokemon. If a love disc is left on its own, it becomes despondent, leaving itself open to attack. That's why Pelipper snatched them up. That is the law of the jungle, my friend. It's a girl, so naturally I'll call it Ace. There we go. And send it to a box. Well done. Right then. Let's get ourselves a trivia question. So. Oh, that is just in the right wrong place. Right. Random number generator says number 64. Sixty-four is from Spectre. Pokeboo is the Japanese name for which Pokemon? Is it Litwick, Pumpkaboo, Tepig, or Gulpin? Ooh. Now, obviously, I want to say Pumpkaboo because it's the closest thing to Pokeboo, but that to me is too obvious. <coughs> I kind of want to say Litwick because Spectre's favourite Pokemon is Chandelure and maybe he's trying to throw out a little hint. But... That makes me think it's either Tepig or Gulpin, because I know Spectre, and I know he ain't the kind of guy that would drop hints. He would be like, no, 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 I'll put these in to throw him off. I think it's Tepig or Gulpin. I reckon Tepig has a different name, so I'm going to go with D, Gulpin, by sure, just a pure guess. And it's wrong! What was it? Oh, it was Tepig! Oh, well, I didn't know that. Well, take a credit off. We need to wonder trade anyway. That's a shame. Let's uh, let's trade. Uh, you're connected to the internet. Would you like to continue? Yeah, let's do it. Oh, and a lot of you are probably wondering what happens if we get to zero credits, Liam. What happens then if you if you fail a trivia? Does it go to minus numbers? No. If I fail a trivia question and I have no credits. I have to release a Pokemon from my actual party. That's the rule I've just made just then off the top of my head, and that's the rule I'm sticking to. Which could be nightmare fuel. Just making the trivia, trivia element more intense, you know? Where is this tweet? Okay, so tweet, and a five, four, three, two, one. Let's do it. Let's get this Pokemon sent out. Goodbye, love disc. I'm never going to use you. So goodbye, good night, and God bless. Here we go. Anything? Ooh, we got Romain from France. From La France. <clears throat> Let's see. What's Romain got for me? Something cool. Something brilliant. <clears throat> Where are we? What you got? Ar we've had Ariados before, so we have to re-roll. I think we've literally got one in our PC. Don't send me an Ariados. Who do you think I am? Goodbye, Ariados. Don't get comfy. Saving. Okay, here we go. So, trade, wonder trade, start. Yep, there's our Ariados. You can go away. Trade, tweet, five, four, three, two, one. Hell yes. Come on then, Ariados. Let's do this. Go away. Go away, mate. Come on, somebody's got to want an Ariados. I know they don't. Nobody wants one. 
Maybe Guzma. It's your boy, Guzma. He wants an Aria dose. Uh, Maru from Japan. Let's see, Maru, what you got for me. Oh, is it going to be something good, though? That's what I'm worried about. Please. Something crazy good. Alolan Raticate. You know what? Just for the hell of it, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use a credit. I think we've got one. Pretty sure we've got like. I think we've got one left. One. We've got one or two left, I think. So I'm gonna use a credit. Oh, Raticate's date will be added to the Pokedex. How wonderful! Great. Boy, oh boy. Uh, it forms a group of Ratata, which it assumes command of. Each group has its own territory, and disputes over f oh, and disputes over food happen often. All right, we're doing one more wonder trade because I'm never going to use something that's. I was a. Do you know what I was about to say? I was about to say I'm not going to use something that's four times weak to fighting type moves, but I quite happily used a Pawniard. which if I gain a safe number of credits, I may ask for again. Three, two, one. Let's wonder trade. Let's do this. And obviously that credit will have been taken off, which is good news. Right then. Let's do this. Please, someone send me something awesome. Whatever it's going to be is going to be the replacement for Voltorb. Well, not necessarily. Charmander currently has that, that seat. Someone from Japan whose name I cannot pronounce. Sinnoh is the best. I completely agree. Let's see what we got. <clears throat> Let's see. Come on. Third time's the charm. A Bacon. I mean, I'm not the biggest Salamence fan, but I'll take it. Oh, we've already got a dragon type in the party. I'm going to use Charmander, but a, 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 Bagon is a good backup. Bagon is a very good backup. Bagon's data will be added to the Pokedex. Let's do it. Come on. It's the Rockhead Pokemon. It's belief... It's belief that it would be able to fly one day is apparently the influence of information carried in its genes. Why is it the Rockhead Pokemon, but it's just pure Dragon type? Surely it should be Dragon and Rock. But oh well, who am I to judge? Right, let's leave this place. We've got a few more trainers to fight just before we head into Kony Kony City. Let's fight this guy. I keep repeating fair battles with Pokemon trainers. What kind of person is a fisherman? <clears throat> I don't understand what you're talking about. I don't understand what he means. But we're going to take him out anyway. He's got really kind eyes. I feel bad just destroying his chin chow, but at the same time, I, I don't. We should just jump straight in with the dragon tail. Yep, you know it, Jangmawo. Let's do this. Chin chow? More like chin ow. Am I right? Come on, dragon tail. Done. And one more. Okay, you're really trying, but... You... Oh, you got the paralysis. Come on, mate. Shake that off. Just shake it off. Shake it off. Off, off. Come on. Anybody? We beat Mike. Well done. Well done, Mike. For getting beat. Now, there was a sightseer lady up here. If you're going to Kony Kony, you should stop by Olivia's... Kuna Olivia's shop, right? She sells stones you can use on a Pokemon to make them evolve. Yeah, we can evolve our Pikachu. Okay, well, here's Kony Kony. It's huge. Not. There's a Deli Boyd. Okay, Deli Bird, where are you going? Oh, look, it's Probo Pass, and he's just casually... He's wider than the doors. How does he get in and out? There's a mystery. Hello, people. Can I have stuff? Wouldn't you like some lovely smelling... No. Lomi Lomi is the style of massage we... Oh, actually, do you know what? I should get... Can I get luck incense? I don't I don't want Lomi Lomi, thank you. I'd like to buy... If you have... If you have the luck incense. 11,000 though, Liam. 
We can probably find it somewhere. Yeah, but it's a long-term investment, okay? Because I can give it to my Jangmoo, who's going to be in the front of the party for a long time. Yes, he's got a scope lens. She's got a scope lens, but we don't we don't care. Yeah, I'll, I will do that. I will give you the luck incense. So when we do battle, we'll get more prize money, and in the long run, it will be a good investment. I want to go to the Pokemon Center. Oh, but clothes. There's a clothes shop, mate. We can't afford anything now. We spent all our money. Yes, I'd like to buy. What you got for me? You got... Athletic tank. Sandy gas tank. Leopard tea. Necktie tea. Cherim tea. Sporty tank, sporty tank, sporty tank. I don't know if I'm a sporty tank kind of person. What about... What about trousers? Oh, no. Sneakers. They're perfect. We've got just enough money for them. Uh, yeah, we'll go, we'll go with the white with the black on. Thank you. Yes, I'd love to put on my latest purchases. At least we have decent shoes now. Okay, thank you. Let's go to the Pokemon Center and heal up. And I'll put Charmander in the party. Let's do it. What what are you doing? Yo, I'm a herb seller. I'm self-taught, but good, sell good quality herbs. No, I, I don't trust any random guy selling herbs in the street. And you shouldn't either, kids. Remember that. Okay, just quickly to the PC. Sorry, Voltorb. The, the majority have said get rid of you, so... Charmander's now in the party. An adamant Charmander. Ugh. What about Bagon? Bagon's adamant. Bagon has Dragon Dance. Oh, I only knows Rage. I'm, I'm kind of tempted. You're a bold Porygon too. Sorry, Porygon. Bold Porygon? Let's look at your summary. Oops. So... Your defense is increased instead of your attack. I mean, that's fine. That's good for a Porygon, I guess. Um, you got the download ability. That's very good. You have Rock Head. And you have your attack increased in favor of special attack because you're adamant. Yeah. Maybe. I don't know. Do you know what? I will leave the vote to you guys. Do you know what? I'm going to put everything back to normal. So... I'm going to put Voltor back in the party, just so I don't have to edit the thing. Ha! <laughs> I'm going to put Straw Poll in the description, which is, which of the three Pokemon that we received today do you think we should put in the party in place of Voltorb, or should we leave Voltorb where he is? So I'll put a Straw Poll, it'll be Voltorb, Porygon, Bagon, or Charmander, which one you want. So if you want to vote on it, go in the description below, cast your vote, and we'll see. But thank you for watching. I hope you liked this video. If you did, hit the thumbs up button. really helps me out. And of course, hit subscribe so you never miss a video from me. And of course, don't forget to click the little bell next to the subscribe button so you always get notified of when a new video goes up. I'm Ace Trainer Liam. Thank you for watching. But until next time, keep on training.